Well, I'm not sure the exact number. Could it be eight, nine, ten? Let's put it this way. A lot of winners for the uh, uh, sire, William Longsword, over the last couple of race meetings. Uh, William Longsword is absolutely firing, his progeny are firing on all cylinders. So let's not say exactly the amount, let's just say lots of winners for William Longsword. And here's another one, a handsome grey son of William. Vasfontein Stud, the breeder, and uh, Mr. Uh, Rakesh Sugalim, the owner. And Elliot is the groom, and he gets 2,000 rand on behalf of Hollywood Bets and on behalf of Gold Circle. Well done, Elliot. Uh, this grey looked outstanding. Well done. Thank you. Sean Veal is going to come back to us in a moment, but let's get Vaughan in uh, to uh, get things underway. And yeah, he's a lightly raced uh, a horse, Vaughan, but uh, you know he's now notched up his second win. I thought he would have been some time back, but he, he's always done enough to keep everyone interested. Warren is a very, very big baby, you know, really. Um and uh, I gave him a run here last year, but uh, he wasn't really ready for it either, and he ran a very good race. But he, he, he's, he's coming along the right way, but he's just immature. He, looking at him in the winner's box now, you're 100% correct, because he, he's such a magnificent individual, and, 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 and you haven't pushed him. I mean, he's only his 10th start, and he's had a handful of runs, and now I'm sure once he's got the confidence, we, you know, he'll go on and give the, the, Mr. Suganum some fun. No, I think, fun. I think he will, you know, and, and also over the extended distance, you know. We were a bit wary and, and he, maybe he wouldn't go that far, but in that 2-4 the other day, he showed that he, he did it comfortably. And now today he won a good race and uh, he certainly is there. Yeah, lovely. Wonder, wonderful, Vaughan. Congratulations. And uh, please send our best to uh, Rakesh. And, uh, yeah, these colours are, are, are always in the winner's box and he deserves every winner. Absolutely. And good luck to him, you know. It's, it's just the pleasure having horses for him and having winners for him. Lovely Vaughan, spot on. Thanks very much. There we go, that's a Professor Snape. Let's chat about Professor Snape who you've ridden in his last two starts and as Vaughan says, immature and yeah, he's a lovely horse. When, you know, you look and you, you, you see a couple of runs, one or two in different runs, but he's learning as Vaughan says and, and, and he, he's got a lovely turn of foot, hasn't he? Yes, Warren, you know, in, when I rode him last time, he sort of moved up with me and like hit a fl flat spot, but he wasn't like helping me even today he traveled a little bit but the horse in front of me never dragged me to where i wanted to so that's why i moved up a bit earlier than i wanted to but that saying that you're right warren he, he's got this big frame about him he's got a lot still to learn L like we always think he's, he's a bit of a brass but at the same time he's doing everything right like he doesn't travel in a race i said to mr marshall last time we're taking this blinkers off him and uh at home he doesn't work with blinkers and he, he sort of works well and uh, even like today he traveled but I wish the horse in front of me dragged me a little bit closer to them if I was sitting behind Smanga I think you would have won easier so well done to Mr. Marshall thank you to Rakesh for the opportunity once again I'm glad I can put Mr. Marshall another winner still two more to go for him before he leaves here yeah? I wish I was in the next race ran but it doesn't matter we'll go back to the drawing boards and uh, just well done to everybody concerned with this horse and to my wife and my two boys, this one's for them. Before you run away, two quick questions. The first one, can you have another winner? Ah, Warren, you know, Honshu just won his maiden, but I think quite a bit of him. I think the handicap was a little bit harsh on him. He's a young horse, he hit him at 88, but at the same time, he, I think he's quite a smart horse and uh, if he brings his work, he'll make them run. The last thing is I've known you for 20 years and you know that you've got a great sense of humour and I've got a great sense of humour. I've got no hair. Was there load shedding when you went to the barber? You know, myself and my young boy, we cut our hair the same. If, if, if you go and look, he loves Ronaldo. He wants everything like Ronaldo. So he said, Dad, you're sitting with me? Me as a sucker I am. I sat there. He watched them cut my hair. I watched them cut his hair. And uh, so we both got this big stripe across our heads. But uh, it's all with a fun one. Absolutely. I wish I could have the same stripe. Well done, Sean. Have a boy. <laughs> there we go, Sean Veal. He knows how to get the past the post, and he's got a wonderful sense of humor as Sean. And yeah, this is Mr. Sugulim's horse. And uh, there we go. If I want to stripe like Ronaldo and Sean and his son, I've got to have a boy, I'm told.